This is a video that's going to explain about the energy bubble concept and theory that I have. We all have our own bubble, our own energy bubble around us that keeps us connected to the beingness of who we are. And when I'm in the center of the bubble, I can feel my connection to the source of unconditional love and all that feels well in the world. From the center of my bubble, I think thoughts like I am and I can, I know, and I have enough for today. I am, I can thoughts bring good feelings. They keep us in our flow, in our alignment, at the center of our energy bubbles. When I'm in the center of my bubble, I am doing what I want to do and being exactly who I want to be in the world. All feels well. What I also know for sure is that we are fully human and fully spirit, fully divine, and it is in our humanity, it is totally normal for all of us to step outside of this alignment and connection to the source of unconditional love. In the center of our bubble, we feel in our flow, where all is well and we feel one with God, or whatever name you like to call the source of unconditional love. We all have unique gifts of passion within our flow. Our flow is where the source of unconditional love meets our soul within us in our energy bubble. Sometimes we step out of our flow and think, I can't thoughts, I can't thoughts bring heavy, uncomfortable feelings. When we think I can't thoughts and feel bad, we often start to do more to try to make up for it and feel better. Or we can get scared or angry and do nothing and expect God to just make things happen. Sometimes I step out and I get into the doing too much. Or I get into the being too much. When I step outside of my alignment, I will start to feel negative emotion. Negative emotion then will be my signal. It is time to stop and start asking myself some important questions like what am I thinking? What is my intention here? And what is it that I want? What is one baby step I could take here today in the direction of my desire? Our heavy, uncomfortable, negative feelings are just signals that we have left our flow where God works with us and through us by thinking our own, I can't, I'm not, I don't have, and I don't know thoughts. And we can always change our thoughts. Heavy feeling emotions can become one of our greatest gifts if we let them. How? By using our energy bubbles. So the negative emotion is a time to stop, ask myself questions, and regain alignment. The law of inertia says that when I'm going in one direction, I will continue to go in that direction, and one object in motion will continue to stay in motion until st unless stopped by an outside force. So if I'm starting to do too much and step outside of my alignment with the source of unconditional love, I will continue to go in that direction until I use some tools such as being able to stop and use my energy bubble. This book will show you the simple steps on how to use your energy bubble. You will learn how to take yourself from heavy, uncomfortable, negative emotions to productive actions from your flow and into your happier, more fulfilling life. It is available at www.henschelhousebooks.com or amazon.com or for an immediate downloadable copy see the products tab of pattyjacksonlifecoach.com and don't forget to add your energy bubbles success stories to our energy bubbles Facebook community page. All your feelings are a gift. Learn how to use them.